Hello, I'm Bruce McMakin of PBA Galleries of San Francisco, auctioneers and appraisers of rare books, manuscripts, photographs, maps, ephemera, and related materials. I'd like to show you a few highlights from our auction 521 on December 5th, 2013, Fine Literature with Illustrated and Children's Books, comprising a wide selection of material in all price ranges. Uh, the most valuable item in the auction is this true first edition of Lady Charlie Slover. Uh, by D.H. Lawrence, one of 1,000 copies signed by the author, privately printed in Florence, Italy. It is not to be confused with the numerous and far less valuable uh, private editions, which also claimed spuriously the limitation of 1,000 copies, but were not signed and were printed on much cheaper paper. The present copy is attractively bound in decorative paste paper boards backed with white pigskin, and is expected to sell for between $7,000 and $10,000. Next up is this complete set of the seven volumes of the C.S. Lewis classic fantasy, The Chronicles of Narnia, all first American editions published between 1950 and 1956, and in the original dust jackets. All but one of the volumes come from the files of the Horn Book, the oldest magazine in the United States dedicated to reviewing children's literature. The set is estimated at $4,000 to $7,000. There are a number of examples of original illustration art in the auction, including this pen and ink drawing by Garth Williams, published in E.B. White's Stuart Little, showing the talkative mouse being washed overboard from his Central Park Pond sailboat, The Wasp. This should sell for between $3,000 and $5,000. Among the many volumes in the auction written and illustrated by Theodore Geisel, better known as Dr. Seuss, is this copy of The Seven Lady Godivas, his first book for adults, inscribed to his wife's piano teacher, and is also predicted to sell for between $3,000 and $5,000. The selection of Oz books in the sale is headlined by these two jacketed copies of L. Frank Baum first editions, The Tin Woodman of Oz and Glinda of Oz, each of which is fetched between $3,000 and $5,000. And finally, we have a large collection of books by the inimitable Edgar Rice Burroughs, including his Tarzan series, Mars and Venus books, and other creations. Many are early and very collectible Gross and Dunlap reprints and jackets, but there are also some first editions, including this copy of Tarzan, Lord of the Jungle, published by McClurg in 1928, and this copy of The War Chief, a scarf, scarce and historically accurate novel about the Apache War with the white man in the Southwest. Both are estimated at $800 to $1,200. Again, this auction of fine literature with illustrated and children's books will take place on December 5, 2013, with the catalog currently posted online at www.pbagalleries.com, and there is live bidding over the Internet during the auction, pre-sale dynamic bidding, absentee through our website with email notification if you are outbid, and you may contact the galleries to arrange phone bidding on for specific lots. Thank you.